there's so many things you could say yes to in this membership world and social media world. And I still struggle with it because there's so many social media platforms you should be working on and having growth on this one and this one and this one, and it's exhausting. So I think being able to say no to things that aren't actually going to help you in business, even if they make it look like you're doing well, um, I think that's really important too. I think a lot of people go for followers and likes, but those don't really convert a lot. So I think it's hard when I see other people growing really fast on Instagram and they look super successful and I'm sitting here like not even posting on Instagram because I have found that it doesn't help me. I don't convert anything and focusing on other things when it's like, there's always that other thing pushing, Hey, you should do this. You should do this. So saying no to things that are really not going to help you at all or just help you a little, but they're going to help maybe with how it looks on the outside. Yeah, exactly. That's, a big thing that's, too. that's what everybody wants though. Mm -hmm. They want every people want them to think they're successful. Right. And yes. you know what? I don't want anyone to think I'm successful. I <laughs> yeah. want to be successful. <laughs> like, right. Like, yes. I, you know, like we don't have the biggest social media. It's so funny. We went to an event one time mm -hmm. and this person got up there. I'm not going to try to identify anybody here. They, they were, they looked so put together. Mm -hmm. They were gorgeous. They had a gorgeous YouTube channel. They had gorgeous social media. They had gorgeous everything. Mm -hmm. And they were, and, and everyone was like, oh man, they got to speak at this event. They look so successful mm -hmm. and got to talking to this person. And we literally made 10 times more money than them the year yeah. before. And I was like, maybe I don't want all those followers. Maybe that, that was actually, we, that happened really early in our journey that we, that, that we encountered that. And I remember having a conversation in Jocelyn in the hotel room. I'm like, all these people on stage, Jocelyn, I think we're way more successful than they are. Mm -hmm. And they don't even know it. Like, yeah. right. Like they feel more successful. They're getting the, right. they're getting the love, the yes. rub and right. And, and I'm not dogging them. I don't want anyone to, right. think this is, right. but I'm just like, man, you know, like I, I had a meeting with my team this morning and we were talking about uh, downloads for Libsyn mm -hmm. and our podcast downloads. And we were looking at this, that, and this, that, and that, that, and the other, and there's a lot of trends and this and that and the other. And, and one of my team members was like, I don't really get this data. And I'm like, Hey, listen, that data point is interesting, mm -hmm. but it doesn't matter because you know what does matter? Our revenue is up this month. Right. That's what matters. So it's a clue why that's happening, but really what got deposited? That's, mm -hmm. that's what matters and what you should say yes to. Right. Like what caused that to happen, you know? Mm -hmm. um, but saying no to things is harder when you're more successful because yes. you have the money to go hire the person. Mm -hmm. You have the idea to buy the course and hire the person to run the thing. Mm -hmm. So the temptation becomes worse. Oh, yes. Yeah, I've I thought about that. I could have somebody maybe do my Instagram for me. But when I look, look at the metric, metrics of how many people click through and how much time I'm spending on posting something, it doesn't convert well. So I'd rather spend the money on having somebody um, do some type of other marketing or do something for my website that is actually going to make me money versus wasting it on that. So I think having deep diving into like your metrics of, is this actually working or is, are you just gaining random people? Oh yeah, that's true. Uh, ooh, look at my 100,000 followers that don't buy anything. Right. 